bam, bam, ba, down. Theme song. Welcome to Solid Content, a very special episode of Solid Content because we have uh, another chapter in my ongoing adventure to try and get Mrs. Solid Content, who is joining us. That's me. <laughs> to try and get her into video gaming. And to do that, she has found a bunch of some beta games, some intros and, and free games that she wants me to try. And I'm hoping this gets her addicted to games. <laughs> so, hey, it's worth a shot. So we're going to try these weird games you found. Uh, this is called Dunk Egg. What is, why did you pick this game? Um, I Mrs. saw Solid? a screenshot or like okay. a little, little video of the little characters. And yeah. they seem to be eggs who are saving people or saving other eggs. <laughs> and I thought that looked cute. Right. And I like a good little pun. Throughout history, soldiers have ruled the breakfast table. What? Oh, like little egg soldiers. Eggs had no choice but to surrender their gooey yolks to the toast in charge. Oh, that's so cute. <laughs> okay, press again. The music here. is so wild. One brunch, the eggs had enough. Uh, what began as a dispute on a small town kitchen worktop became a universal war for independence. Eggs were called from farms and fridges everywhere to come together in battle for life free from egg cups. <laughs> Those soldiers were heartless opponents. But these eggs didn't crack under pressure. Okay, so I see why you like this game. It's mostly just puns. I love puns. Okay, okay. I will say the Dunk music egg. gives me oh. like a heart. Oh, we're right racing. into it. Stay calm, my good egg. We will get you to the hospital in time. See, they're so cute. The last time we did this, our patient splatted down a hill, and that's not. Ah! <gasps> oh. Keep Greg. Keep Greg, Greg alive. Q and E. Okay. <gasps> oh. What? Oh no! There's like. Oh. <gasps> Ah, oh. You already failed! <laughs> Press face to try Greg again. is dead! Okay. Q and E turns. So are you moving them individually? How does this work? Oh my work? goodness. Oh, yeah, and kind... DNA is forward and back? Oh no! <laughs> wow, so this is hard! It's kind of like there's a game called Quop. Okay, E turns it, and then A goes backwards, W goes <gasps> forward. Oh, you made it. Oh, oh. How do I go oh, forward? Look at the little eggs mustache. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> I can't figure out how to go forward this way. No. Okay. Oh. <laughs> you have no idea <laughs> oh, where no. the eggs are gonna come. Is the oh, problem? Oh my goodness! <laughs> I feel like you're trying to go to. Oh. No. Watch out on your end, sir. So I think we need to go that way. Okay. Okay. Hang well, on. Yeah. And yeah. Then, and then S goes forward, and A goes backwards. Okay. Well, no. You're okay, so, so bad e at it. So E goes. E rotates okay. forward. Oh, you're doing good. Okay, Q. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Stay balanced. D. Cooper. Sorry, I got a bit scrambled. <laughs> huh? Oh, the toaster. Whoa. Oh, nice. <laughs> you're doing so well. Here we go. Here we go. <gasps> Where am I so going, many though? There's so dead bodies. Yeah, it's war. <gasps> war is brutal. Oh, they just slide when you bump into them. <laughs> <laughs> See, do you like video games now? Benedict? The names of the eggs are all like eggy names. He's bleeding egg. <gasps> no. Be careful, He's kind losing fellow. A lot of He's yolk. losing a lot of yolk. Oh, no. No! Oh, no! no! All the way back to the start. <laughs> oh, no. If I press shift, does that run? No. Oops. Oh, no. <gasps> Spa okay, space <laughs> bar restart. Space bar starts over. Okay. I just think the animation is so cute. Yeah, the this. animation is cute. I like the the. the ah! I like the like bouncing little eggs. Yeah, the bouncing helmets and stuff too. Good. It's kind of like driving a forklift or something. Although I've never driven a forklift, <laughs> so I don't really know. Peter, describe driving a forklift. Well, imagine you're two eggs carrying a wounded egg. <laughs> oh no! Ah! The shadows make me so nervous. Yeah, okay, so there's shadows. <gasps> I mean, we don't have to win. Oh, this we do. This is just do. a little, oh, I'm See, and wrong. This, and this is the thing I'm trying to get you hooked on with video games, is like, this could be the rest of your day if you wanted. It I know we have, be. Oh, they're mad oh, at each other. No! <gasps> oh, no! <laughs> I gotta start all over again. Uh, I believe in you? Oh, Good nice. Save. So there's, okay, so we haven't seen like a nurse play, a medal ahead, get oh, the medal. Oh, get the medal. <laughs> Shiny. Oh, what does it do? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I just had to turn the whole way around. Oh, that was cute. Okay, so I need to. Okay. <gasps> no! Okay, turn. Okay, so you can only. Uh oh. Oh, no. I gotta uh... go back. Where's the AK? Okay, I gotta go okay. back. And then. Nope. I gotta go back some more. <laughs> and then I gotta turn my butt. Oh, there that's so frustrating. 
why are they shelling us with eggs? With other eggs, yeah. yeah. That'd be like if we were in a war and they were just throwing humans at you. Cool. Oh my goodness. Yes, I did it. <gasps> yes, I did it. I got through. That was amazing. I don't know. I don't know if I... What's that? Is oh, that, that an egg? That statue, or that statue, that shadow keeps There's the, freaking me out. I think that's where I'm trying to go. Ah. Yeah, it looks like, like a nurse's tent. Ah. Like in the movies. Yeah, yeah, we did it, we did it. Ah. My heart is racing. Ah, see, this is video games. Swing out the back. <gasps> Come on in. Yes, we did it. You kept Greg alive. It took you 88 <laughs> seconds to get alive. We did it. Oh, I got no medals, though. That's okay. I don't uh, know. It didn't seem to do anything. Uh, oh, you completed it. We did it. Like, I did it. I beat the, the game. Yeah. We're going to start with Burn Me Twice. Dun, dun, dun. The reason I chose it was they're cute little witches. And I figured that's a great reason to play a game. So, Believers, raise your torches for there's a witch among our ranks. Light the pyres, burn the heathen, oh heavens. May your faith <laughs> never be faltered for great lady's light and her seven saints. Uh, oh, by that someone. Doesn't... We didn't get to see that. That sounds kind of weird. That doesn't sound like normal, like Christians burning witches. This is like another, like a fantasy realm that also doesn't like witches. Mm, we're strong. Big hands. Interesting. Mitten hands. <laughs> Mitten hands. <laughs> uh, I feel like there should be dialogue here. Are we missing dialogue? Are the preparations ready? <gasps> the doctor, he's wearing one of those masks we talked and about. And whoever this is, no need to be so impatient. Everyone's going, sm Ooh. everything's going smoothly. That's for me to decide. Hold up your end of the bargain first. You be the other person. Okay. Still suspicious? <laughs> Everything will be fine. You'll see. I guess I'm evil. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You've decided to be evil. <clears throat> oh, I don't have any more lines. <laughs> you were ready. Oh, <laughs> I've already waited too long. I want results. Leaving behind a dead wasteland. For you only then will be before the stars is written in the stars above. Okay, better. Thank you. That's a better speed. Thank you. Okay, come on, action. Let's go. Okay, the intro oh, to the game. Go. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> Abigail von Rottenhartz, the witch employed by Santa Linnea's Inquisition, uh, accuses Dr. Fausto of being responsible for the plague spread uh, in our peaceful village. Is a plague? And through witchcraft, no less. I'll be there. <laughs> we know the feats are such possible magic. Blah, 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 blah. Dr. Fausto is not as hard bad. Blah, blah, blah. I don't think he's guilty of anything. No, nobody will believe you just like that. Is this game you better just show a us story? some evidence that may it might just be a story. Okay, here we go. All right, so inventory hat. It's Cute. just your hat, cliche but stylish. You better show us some evidence that may prove a connection between Dr. Fausto and the plague. Oh. I don't have any evidence that <laughs> isn't my hat. Your hat? As for you, Lady Abigail, may the holy flame of purity corrupt your. Uh, uh, wh that Wait. was fast all of a sudden. Yeah. Considering it was slow before. Oh, I get what. Because here, look, we got an achievement unlocked. Burn me once. The game is called Burn Me Twice. So now. Mm. She, we're going to come back and we have another chance at getting burnt. I mean, the artwork is really cool. This is very so Lion King, uh, like 93 or whatever year. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Like in the, the skull. Part where they're, yeah, yeah. And there's the elephant tusks. Or... Okay. One thing I will say for this game is uh, the pace could probably step up the pace just a little bit. It's very, it's cinematic. Is this her leader? I thought you were going to say like her boyfriend or something. Fate can be ironic. Malab. Okay, can't it? I need another chance. <laughs> Just the game over. Like, I wish it was in peace. Game over. We're done. What do I... Oh, yeah. Okay. You're cautious, witch, aren't you? All I ask is for it uh, to be your shadow, to witness all your feats and failures. Oh, he just wants to hang out. That's cute. Now, just as I promised, let's go back to a time when you could still save your life. Learn from your past errors. You'll only die, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> <laughs> I formally welcome you to our little border town. Uh, I was going to order your execution for this very night. Oh, <laughs> I was going to kill you tonight, but I guess you're lucky. Oops. A new outbreak of the plague is in the cursed slums. Yeah, that's where we were supposed to go. Are worried of catching it while they investigate its source, but witches like you are immune to sickness. Oh, that's not bad. If you find the cause of the outbreak, I'll set you free. That was a lot of There's exposition. There's a lot of reading and exposition, yeah, to get this game going. We so far haven't done anything in the game. And I th oh, okay, for heaven's sake. I think that sometimes it's better if the game uh, starts off with a little bit of walking around first. And then, and then you get into the exposition. Well, and then you can kind of be curious first. Yeah. She did say something in the intro that was like, I did write something on a piece of parchment. Oh, so, so maybe, maybe look for some parchment. For okay, okay. Look at all these bodies. This is so Aww. sad. It's so relevant. Oh. 
Oh, smells. Okay, so we got to talk to these people. We got to interact with these people at some point. Now, another thing I just noticed is, so these are little interaction points, like little points of interest, but also check this out. Our little hat starts to jingle right here. Oh. What do you suppose that means? <laughs> yeah, I just mashed the can keyboard. Can you like and take off happened. your hat? I, well, I can't know. do anything. I can only run around or press E. So let's go take a look. Let's go inspect a body. Let's go inspect this gentleman here. The patient's affected by the plague are just behind that curtain. It gives me the creeps. Oh, back here. Oh, there's even more. Okay, there's okay. There's so many sounds of coughing. Yeah. This is actually kind of like... A bit much for you? Yeah. <laughs> oh, there is much more back here. And now we're dingling again. E. Always on time, aren't you, Abigail? Now we've met Celine. Celine Dion! <gasps> Canada's finest. Okay. Okay. Here we go. We're entering the realm of the dead. Uh, whoa. Realm of the Dead. Oh, this is quite a lot of reading in this game. <laughs> it's not so much a game as it is an experience. Yeah, I think it's kind of like an interactive story. Mm -hmm. Dustenburg is no ordinary town. Sometimes something sinister hides stock, oh. hides stocks its streets, and your duty is to stop it. For it will shine brightly whenever you're near a source of spectral energy. Is that what the jingle thing was? Because it did have a light. Right. Now let's go back to the realm of the living. <laughs> That's pretty cool, though, to know that there's two different... Realms? Yeah. The two realms. Oh, am I going to talk to this person again? Okay, I hope you found the way. Uh, goodbye. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Here we go. Who are you guys? Hospitals are pain-filled oh. places. Contrary to what the living believe, spirits don't enjoy living in places like this. I don't think I don't I think any think li that. Yeah, I don't think living people have ever been like, man, I bet spirits love hospitals. Okay, important question. Yeah. If you were to haunt a place, yeah. what place would you haunt? Oh, I would haunt a theme park, I think. Like um <gasps> right? Cuz then I would just go on the roller coasters and stuff when it was open. Nobody would really notice that I was just like there was a ghost. Okay, so we did we checked out some ghosts in that area there. Large variety could you tell seem to be of great quality. Oh, okay. Cool. Thanks. Good. Thanks for letting me know that. Thanks Crossroads in. Chagoon. Okay, that's kind of cool. Yeah, that part is cool. Stuff was happening like Absolutely. That. I'm waiting for Celine to finish cooking. Her dishes are just the best. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Wait, what's this person all about? He could be hiding something? Mm, ah, dun, okay, dun, here dun. we go. It's Dr. Fausto's office. There's a square like indentation on the table. Something might fit in here. Something's gonna fit in there. We have to find we have to find something square like. The music is cool. The game is cool. Oh, we haven't been here before. It's really pretty. Yeah, it's very pretty. <laughs> Wait, there it is. Okay. I got a little something square. <laughs> I like to think of the sound designer who spent uh -huh. some time like, alone going like... <laughs> <laughs> Getting the coughs yeah. just right. It fits. Okay, and now we unlock this area. Fausto. So this Fausto guy we got to find. So if I press tab, it brings down my hat and my Fausto's diary. We haven't talked to this guard yet. Ah, witch, you again. What do you need? Oh, we could go to the cursed slums. Okay, let's go see what it is. Yeah. I mean, we're killing it here, but... <laughs> it's pretty cold here. These are the famous cursed slums. Nothing but ruins, misery, and famine. Since there's no room for new patients at the hospital, we've kept the ill in here. It's a quarantine zone. I'm not going anywhere near this place. You'll have to investigate by yourself. All right, to the spirit realm. Oh, hello, sir. This outbreak seems similar to the one we had 20 years ago. It was discovered that the disease had been caused by a coven of witches back then. Oh, boy. That's what I, that's one of the things that I am. I like when you walk through the curtain and it goes yeah. like, behind you. Like this? Yeah. yeah. See, it's so pretty. Good job on that art person. Yeah, totally. There's another one here. <laughs> oh. I think we found something. Well, we've explored this in the... Now let's go into the normal realm. Ah, ah, sorry <laughs> to pop in on you. Say, why don't you help me investigate the house? I just That's what did. what we've been trying to do. I just investigated it. I didn't even see them there. Oh, this is new. <gasps> Sue? All right. Uh. Whoa. Okay, <laughs> here we go. so yeah, this got different. Ooh. 
just as I feared. Look, Abigail, that's the secret behind the plague outbreak. A blood ritual. Someone must have used a magic circle to summon the disease. Ah, classic magic circle situation. But this arrangement, I wonder what it means. Oh. oh. <gasps> We're at the hospital. To the hospital. All these guards are like, uh, do you want to start the trial maybe? Yeah, that's kind of weird, right? To be like, um, anyway, you're totally on trial. Do you want to, it's, oh, it's totally up to you though. Do you want to go check it out? <laughs> I'm Fausto. Great to know you as a doctor. What do you need? Oh my gosh. Do you have a clue? That's what Can we need. Can you just give us a clue? <laughs> we did it! Oh my goodness. We just forgot <laughs> to talk to Fausto. Were we just Fausto. walking around not talking to him? <laughs> We forgot to talk to Fausto. Literally the most important person, the one that they talk about, like every character talks about. <laughs> they we read your to. diary. So I think the thing, the lesson that I've learned with these kinds of games is you need to, you talk to everybody. Let's start the trial. Got everything you need? Let's go to the Chamber of Ordeals so you can share <laughs> your I like findings. that name. Let's find out if we survive the trial. I, Ulrich von Dustenberg, Supreme Inquisitor and Lord of the Mortal Lands, declare the court seat. Oh, this is a lot of reading. This is like basically a book game. Let's see if you've been paying attention. Oh, Which? no, we haven't been. Can you remind the court of the first symptoms? That's uh, not how you spell symptoms. That's how you spell, how you spell, symptoms. It. <laughs> how you spell yeah. it. There you go. <laughs> well, okay, first symptoms oh, of the disease include okay. coughing and fever. Phew. Phew. <laughs> we did do our homework. <laughs> you heard him who is responsible for the outbreak. Oh, right. Dr. Fausto. I mean, is it? Well, because Dr. Fausto was doing the he ceremony say, and like, stuff. I failed. Wait, the judge can't say that. The judge was just like, I think he's fine. So I think this one. You should read it very closely. Okay, this part is kind of fun, to be honest. You're picking the right thing. What? <gasps> oh, no. He's sending something. Ah, yes. Ah. <sighs> The evidence has been accepted. <laughs> uh, okay, is there any other proof that may link him to this dreadful ritual? The, uh, the pail, right? Yeah, the blood, I guess. Because it was in, also yeah, in Fausto's his office, Yeah, secret laboratory, right? and it reads for the slums. I can confirm that Gaspar is hooking Thank us you guy. up. Yeah, Gaspar's got our back. Kind of think we're actual lawyers. Forget now. law school. We've yeah. got this. Here he comes. Slender! Why are you trusting the words of an Victorian witch? Order in the court! You're accusing me of reward the ritual of the cursed slums! I've never even been to the cursed slums. Because of Deborah. Okay, the final piece, which must be the only the last piece. Can you defend yourself in any way? <laughs> yeah! Yeah, idiot, can you defend yourself even at all? Confess, confess, confess! Confess! <laughs> 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 He did well, it. All right, I confess. Uh, oh, it's oh my It's probably gosh. because we made him. We yelled yeah. confess at him as well. That was enough people. Back to her tower. Or execute. Wait, so wait. Why am I still under arrest, though? Why are we still... Yeah, I did believe that I was going to be set free. Why am I not set free? No Inquisitor would negotiate with a witch after all. Oh, I see. We're getting double... We're getting double crossed. May your bindings to the material will be released at the gallows. And the great... Li Oh my goodness, so Dr. Fausto is getting hung, and I, we, uh, got betrayed. Who's this lady? Deborah! It's Deborah! Deborah! We, we passed through level one. We finally did it. <laughs> Not, I wouldn't say we did it, like, super successfully. <laughs> I think we did it in the, in the end successfully. It took us a long time, but we were successful. And now here we are in chapter two but i will um okay i mean listen folks comment down below if you want to see how the rest of this uh story goes but i think it's about time we move on to another game all right now we're gonna play you are watching icebox why did you pick this one for me tell me well i know that you happen to like panel shows a lot yeah and we went through a huge phase of lying in bed just watching those british panel shows yes so, so um, true eight or ten cats yeah would I, would I lie to you? Would I lie to you? And yeah. so, I don't you know. Lie. I don't so know good. if they... Oh. oh. Yeah. Anyway, that's why. <laughs> yeah. It already does feel a little Look bit like... Back. Oh. Okay. I'm Bernie Plunkett, right? And you're watching <laughs> Icebox, the coolest show on the box. 
Okay. So this what do I do in the game? So look at that. Look at that tie. Look at that tie link. Kids don't want to watch a washed up comedian twice their age pretend he's one of them. Hey. Quality content. I take that personally. Okay. One mistake. Uh. One oh. cock up. One oh no, the fire. There's a log outside the fireplace. <laughs> Somebody get the fire. But he just fired everyone. No one's going to be able to get it. I think that's up to us. Three, two. Oh my gosh. Okay, we're back. Uh, welcome back. Oh my gosh, she has a. Like okay, a our first guest. Wait, our first guest is zoologist, oh, yeah. Dr. Bachman. Okay, inventory. Nothing. Quit screwing around. <laughs> okay, let's go with the fire the up. curtain's really going up. Do something. Do something. And Why is there a boom mic just taped to the wall? Oh, fire there? extinguisher. Oh, oh, yeah, okay, great. Okay, okay, great. Oi, good looking. Go and introduce me to the folks at home. Uh, <laughs> of course. Can I just... My fuzzy friends get antsy. Okay, one second. <laughs> lady, one <laughs> second. I gotta put out this fire. Do you not see the fire, okay. lady? Yeah. Wait, okay. No, no, don't Oi, worry about... Good looking. Oh, Oi, she's not uh, letting me. Can I... My... I think you have to quickly introduce Okay, I gotta go and introduce her. Yeah, okay, okay. Our first guest today works with all... She's as radical as a raccoon. <laughs> okay, and as cool as, um... As cool as a crocodile. A leftover chicken okay, Kiev. Okay, fine. A crocodile? Leftover chicken Kiev. <laughs> oh, I see. Okay. Do I lose uh, points if I don't say the right I rhyme or something? Welcome to the icebox, Dr. Cosbaum. While she's waffling a camera, sort out... Yeah, okay, great. She's so calm on the on the um, headset. Yeah. Maybe, if you want. Yeah, but that's true of a producer. She would be she would be that calm under pressure. Do you think so if it was on fire, though? Oh, no. I think... <gasps> what on earth? It's a... <laughs> Would it's a gag. It's a gag one. Fire Novelty. Okay. Would you look at that? Oh. I bet those are illegal. I feel like those are illegal. That has to be. Yeah. Get something else. Uh, okay. Um. <laughs> uh, where do we get something? We haven't even dealt with the fire. Blanket. Wait, yeah, I'm trying to deal with the fire. <laughs> that guy's going to get fire. Yeah, he is going to get I'm not excited to solve the problem. It's also not getting out of control, even though they keep saying it's out of control. Yeah, it's so I'm not, not actually. I'm only medium stressed out, and I'm not finding anything else to click on. That's my inventory. Get back on set. <laughs> <laughs> the producer is funny in the background. The producer's funny, and his walk is funny. Those are the two best parts. Get back on set. Get back on set. <laughs> and no, not getting back on set. We did it. Why? Why did you? So why did you pick this one? Well, I don't know if you remember, there's a gif of a cat working really hard at a computer, like, and I saw the hands, and it reminded me of that cat, and I was like, we're going to look at whatever this is. Um, and it was in, like, a games list, but I don't know if you do anything or not. Can you take a drink of coffee? I'm trying to do anything. How do we know if we're winning? <laughs> I think we're winning. All right, why is Office Coffee so bad? Another perfect contender for a very long Let's Play series. What do you think? Oh, I did it. Oh. Okay, I clicked and I zoomed in. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah. Maybe. Maybe. I did just ask you a question. It's just a, a simple question out of politeness, but... Uh, <laughs> there, but I'm just going to keep drinking in front of his face. And I haven't even stopped yeah. typing. <laughs> It's definitely a firmly Whoa. green coffee now. I'm trying not to. I'm trying to put it down. I'm going to need you to put that cup down. I'm trying to. I'm trying to put it down. Ah. I don't want to get in trouble. Uh-oh. What happened? I don't know. You know what this feels like? is one of those, like, VR... Uh, uh, experience. Yeah, 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 like that Rick and Morty one. I just think we're going to keep drinking the coffee. <laughs> Something bad is definitely happening. Oh, my goodness. <gasps> Everyone's screaming. Yeah, this is kind of spooky. Oh my! <gasps> what? Well, I mean, you know what? Honestly, I'm glad we didn't quit earlier. Me this too. is kind of interesting. We would have missed out on something. Oh no! His hand is still going. I'm still typing. Still gotta get those paperwork's done. Numbers, numbers, numbers. Oh, oh my Whoa. goodness! I'm still what typing. Is this? Okay, that was that was kind of cool. Took a while to get here, though. I still, I'm not even convinced it's done. Uh, oh, oh, we're in space. Oh my word. Am I still typing? No, my hand's gone. 
I think I'm going to grab another sip. <laughs> <laughs> and so our hero dives into the unknown depths of time and space. A calendar. <laughs> she has the answers to life's most mysterious questions. Grab another sip of that coffee. There's the, pe the, the phone. There's whatever that is. The future is open to those with coffee on their side, even if it is cheap office coffee. You know what I like to imagine right now? Uh -huh. That the person who made this, like, made it secretly while at work drinking the bad work coffee. Oh, totally. Like, that, that they were coding this then. I have left the void. And with it, we have left the... Okay, well, we beat the game. What do you think of that one? That well, was crazy. Give it on a, a scale of zero to solid. Uh, what do you got? Well, okay, I don't know if I know what the numbers represent uh -huh. like is it would play it again yeah, yeah yeah would you play it again i would probably recommend it to someone to be like you should go do this thing it's really yeah. weird all right and here we are our last exploration of Ooh. of these games there are ghosts in these stalls click anywhere to start let's find out oh, what's gonna happen in. oh okay very cool very cool so far uh, this i think is gonna be a horror game so i'm not sure why you've wanted me to play this game um, I think it's out. mostly the word ghost. Oh, to be so you honest, because like, you know in. me, I like ghosts. Yeah, you do of. like ghosts. Whoa. Weird. Oh. So holding the right mouse button kind of crouches under the stall. Oh, you really got to scroll around. Okay. And. What's that? I don't know. That was kind of scary. <gasps> huh? Okay. Did we collect that or something? I guess we collected that. that? Oh, I see you. Like, are we like? Well, look, is it look, like look. A cipher? On the left there. Yeah. See. Okay. So we gotta keep finding. I would not want to be alone in a dark bathroom stall. I would us. also. I, but I also yeah. don't want to be in one with people. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So you're kind of stuck. Oh, I think that green oh, color wait. was just. There's one there. <gasps> oh. Yeah. Ooh. Got another one. Okay. This game's kind of cool. Game's kind of funky. Okay, I gotta like. It's funny because I believe you were like, "Why did you pick this one?" I know, but I was worried. I was worried did it was gonna be, be a scary game. Be... <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's oh. another one. Ah. Oh my goodness! Okay, there's that's ghosts scary. in the stalls. That's scary. I'm scared. All right, I don't know what that's gonna <gasps> above, do. Above, above, above. On the top right. No. Yeah. Ah. Other, other right. Ah. Go to the other right. I know, but that one. Oh, okay. Ah. But still, that opened, and that's scary. But maybe you're supposed to collect these fast. Okay, I don't okay, know. Okay, just... okay. Cool. We did it. So... <clears throat> Hello. Mr. Ghost? Can I leave? I'm scared. <laughs> did you, like, turn around and look in the toilet at all? I don't what? want to. Like, what if there's, like, a snake in it? Uh, I just started making a weird sound when you said that. Uh, can you... Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh my goodness. I did not enjoy that. This one, I take it back. This one is more like the VR horror games. There's like the psych ward one that I played one time. <gasps> oh. An X. Okay, let's collect this X. <gasps> <laughs> okay, I want everyone to know that Mr. Solid Content here just freaked out. <laughs> he leaned back and jumped so so far back. Oh my goodness. Uh, that was perfect. That was a great way to drag the view up the stall. You see the blood and then you start scrolling up. Oh my goodness, I need a break. Oh, we should oh. have had a cam on you, but no. I didn't know yeah, you were going to we jump so far. I didn't know so that far. was going to happen. Oh, man. Oh, my goodness. All right. There well, you go. I certainly hope you enjoyed this episode of Solid Content, where we tried some of the games that are out there. I think it's important to uh, sneak around and, and try games that are up and coming because you never know where the next gem is going to come from. And also for those new creators, for them to like know yeah. people are out there looking at their stuff. Absolutely. I think that's important. So. You jumped so big. That was scary. You were like, <laughs> no, I want to do it again. <laughs>